I realized na history does repeat itself. And then it kind of just made me feel that if nothing changes, if everybody just keeps silent about this, nothing's gonna change. I graduated from Benilde with a course of Multimedia Arts last October 2019. Um, now I'm working as a graphic designer in a design studio. I went in not knowing who Cirilo Bautista was even. And then uh, slowly I started reading quotes from him, his history. I was assigned to the literal last pages of the, the trilogy. Since I am one of the younger artists, I feel like the last few pages connected with me more because it also meant the more recent ones. So when Cirilo was writing about what I believe was the Marcos administration, I was interpreting it as the current administration. My first idea talaga was to just draw or illustrate or, or collage or whatever. Grab it. The way Cirilo, Cirilo writes his words. Nobody should miss out on this. So that's when I started to incorporate both typography and uh, graphics and illustrations here. Every line or stanza that really stood out to me, that's what I drew. When you look at the issues that Cirilo was talking, you don't really see anything clean or pretty or it's not like grandiose or everything. Reading the trilogy of St. Lazarus, always take everything with a grain of salt. Like, I know his literature is very, very intimidating, but then I think that the point isn't to really get it right. The point is to understand it within your context, which is why, which is what I did. In the last page here, I put, move, move, thought is past thought. To act is to live, dead men's dream, deserve more dreaming. No more scribblings, no more poetry workshops, move, move. He was saying, basically stop writing, stop leaving it on, um, on pieces of paper, on newspapers that time. But on my interpretation, it meant stop just tweeting, stop just saying things and not doing them. So for me, I feel like what Cirilo achieved in his lifetime, we haven't had that yet. I mean, we're still in the same administration and everything. What I hope people can get from all of this is a sense of freedom, a sense of stability and expression in what they can do and what they have the power to do and then move on to the next step rather than just you know stopping after the book ends or stopping after um, you come to a conclusion. <laughs>